There has been a ton of news dropping for X-Men 97 from the initial reactions to Bo DeMeo getting fired to a potential season 3 and a new voice cast. So we're going to go ahead and jump straight into all this starting out with the initial reactions. To give you guys a bit of a background, March 13th they had a X-Men 97 event and a lot of people were invited and got a chance to go and they were showcased three episodes of X-Men 97. First off we got our first initial reaction coming from Jamie Jurak from Phase Zero. She had this to say, the first three episodes of X-Men 97 are absolutely epic. It exceeds expectations in every way. The nostalgia is strong. It's so much more. Beautiful animation, excellent storytelling, and above all, my favorite thing about the X-Men, the drama. We have our next reaction it's coming from Greg Alba from Real Rejects. After rewatching the original X-Men animated series, and now the first couple of episodes of X-Men 97, I can honestly say the series is fantastic. It's how you remember preserving the characters and themes, yet evolved and with a more cinematic touch and beautiful action scenes. And finally, we have our last reaction from Danny Fernandez who says this, the drama, the love triangles, the comedy, the animation. Congrats to the X-Men 97 team and my TAG comrades. Y'all did that, fire emojis. So as you can see, there is tons of high praise and positive reactions towards the series, which gets me even more hype and very excited. Positive, positive high praise for the animation, the storylines, the comedy, all of that. We're going to jump into some X-Men 97 news. Now it turns out from Brad Winterbaum, who is a part of the animation and streaming for Marvel, he confirms that X-Men 97 will have plenty of cameos. He says in I quote, I will say that, you know, just like the original series had some really fun cameos that you didn't expect to happen, you can expect the same thing in X-Men 97. Now if you guys know, creator Bo DeMeo got fired the day before the X-Men 97 premiere. It's been unknown as to why he's gotten fired, but we don't really know the concrete reason as to why. But Brad Winderbaum does in some way give a clarification as to what exactly happened. He says and I quote, I can't talk about the details, he confessed, but I can say that Bo had real respect and passion for these characters and wrote what I think are excellent scripts that really the rest of the team were able to draw inspiration from to build this amazing show that's on screen. If asked if he would consider DeMeo's MCU departure a firing, Winterbaum replied with, I don't. We parted ways is the best way I could say. He's not really saying much to be honest with you about the firing, so hopefully we get some more details as to why he got fired or why they parted ways. We also did get a voice acting confirmation. Your boy Professor Xavier is gonna be back in some capacity in X-Men 97. We got the confirmation that Ross Mar Marquard, who was in Avengers Endgame and What If, will be voicing Professor Xavier in X-Men 97. As far as if he's returning or a flashback, we don't know. We'll have to see on Wednesday when the show comes out. We did get a, another big confirmation from Brad Winterbaum that he confirmed that season three of X-Men 97 is currently in development. There was a rumor going around that X-Men 97 was going to be slated to have four seasons. So it really does seem very likely that that might be the case. But yeah, with all this news coming out, it is a very big, busy time for X-Men 97. I'm going to be doing one big final hurrah video for X-Men 97 until the show comes out, of course, because I will be doing videos talking about the episodes. But with that being said, let me know your thoughts down below with all of the information we've gotten so far. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, turn on those post notifications for more X-Men 97 news over here on the channel. Big love to you all and peace out.